Welcome Aquarius. I'm back y'all with another video. Okay, let's talk guys. Let's go ahead and get into it. I don't know for some reason I just feel like Aquarius is going to have I'm just let me just say I hope you guys have a great read. For some reason I'm just feeling like there's some tea that's about to pop out. <laughs> I'm just feeling like there's some tea, you know? But let's see what we get. This is a general read. It may or may not resonate. If it does not resonate, don't get in the comment section hollering about, oh, it don't resonate. It's not me. Da 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 da. Because guess what? What you can do is check your moon and your rising signs. If you don't get anything there, there's so many other readers, okay? And I love the, the YouTube uh, community as far as the tarot readers. There's a lot of other readers, okay? So, no love lost, you know? But we're going to try to keep it right over here, okay? All right, don't forget, guys, make sure that you are hitting the like button, y'all, so we can keep these videos in rotation, okay? If you would like to book a personal reading, that information is in the drop box below, as well as the website if you would like to place any orders um, as far as, you know, spiritual things, oils, uh, sage, you know, things to that nature. All right, so let's talk, guys. This is going to be for Aquarius for the month of November. November, 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 November. Aquarius. November. What message do you have for Aquarius? All right, see, look at it. Look at this. At the bottom of the deck, we got the Knight of Swords. Okay, so, yeah, and the Queen of Swords. <laughs> Ooh. Okay, let's just see what we get. <laughs> Y'all some rough riders. Aquarius are some rough riders. Like, <laughs> damn, am I just, did I just put out my age? I said rough riders? Like, yeah. But y'all are so, you know, I'm not saying like y'all just rough about everything, but y'all are just like blunt. Y'all straight to the point. Y'all go getters. Okay, so we got the Three of Cups. The Eight of Pentacles, the Magician, okay, and the World. Okay, you're trying to get everybody together. Maybe you're trying to get everybody on the same page, but it looks like somebody here is being negative. Somebody's trying to get somebody on the same page here. I see there's a ending for sure, for sure, because I got the Death card here as well as the Ten of Swords. So let's see what's going on. The Three of Cups is a group, you know, a, a a circle. It looks like someone has a problem with somebody in a circle. Is it you that have a problem with somebody? Somebody feels worried, okay? I'm getting there's a little bit of competition or or uh issues going on. It's just like some back and forth. Some back and forth going on. Okay. All right. What I'm also seeing as well is it looks like you guys are trying to give something some thought. Um, so you, got, you have something on hold. Okay, you're giving something some thought before you take action. Yeah. See, someone possibly said something to make you think. But I see y'all in y'all head. Okay, think about something that happened in the past. So something was brought up possibly that made you think, okay, about something that happened in the past. It made you reevaluate. Made you look back at something like, oh yeah, that show did happen, or you know, it just made you go back and think about the past. Yeah, something from the past. Um, maybe you've gotten over it. Maybe you haven't. Or you're waiting for somebody to get over something. Somebody is trying to come back, though. Somebody, it looks like someone is trying to come back. Come back around. 
Yep. The judgment. Somebody's coming back around for a second chance. Ooh. But it looks like you closed that chapter and you're moving forward. For sure, for sure. Yeah, see, the past energy is the death card. Yeah. You may have, you may haven't been, um, this person hasn't reached out to you or you haven't reached out to this person. Maybe you, you know, you're hearing this from someone, you're hearing some news from someone or something to that nature, but it looks like, um, uh, there was a cutoff in communication. It wasn't the right moment or the right time to talk about it. Okay, or you waiting for somebody to give you the tea. <laughs> yeah, but you feel like maybe they've gotten over it or you, you're over it. Okay. Somebody here is gets real mad or aggressive, like... Maybe you come off as really aggressive to this person or something in that nature. But I'm getting like, you feel like you have to defend yourself. Yeah, because it's a lot of confusion. It's a lot of confusion going on. Yeah, something about wait till later. Okay, see, that's what I'm saying. See, you are going to wait till later to ask this person something or get the tea. But it's like they somebody said, okay, I'm over it now, or you or you're over it. But I'm getting like getting over it. Like you've closed the chapter, or the chapter has closed, and you know, it's no longer a factor. But it looks like you're you want them to come back and try to talk about it. But I'm getting like you wanted the tea, or somebody was bringing you some tea. But they didn't with the Death card and the Knight of Cups and the Ace of Swords. So you didn't get the information in the past. So now you're trying to find out later. Like you want to talk about it. You're like, oh, okay, well, we'll talk about it later. We'll talk about it later. Okay, so it looks like some tea is getting ready to come y'all way for November. Yeah. How others view it, they're they, they are, they're mad about something. But... I don't feel like they're willing to talk about it. Five of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. It's like, yeah, they don't really want to talk about it. We got them as the Ten of Swords and the Four of Cups. They don't really want to talk about it. Yeah, Pay the Swords. They don't want to talk about it. They don't want to talk about it. Because they feel like you saw you saw enough with the Page of Swords. They feel like, oh, okay, well, you know, you saw enough. All right. Uh... This could be a family situation, or this could be like a, a home situation, something that's going on in a home. But it's really toxic, okay? And it could be a disagreement about money. Somebody's being really greedy. Yeah, I'm getting like somebody's really greedy. And somebody just like cussing somebody out or <laughs> talking to them in a very aggressive manner. I'm getting a lot of aggression here. Um, and I, I just feel like there's a lot of negativity going on surrounding this, this situation. But I feel like you're waiting for somebody to come back around and tell you what happened. So something happened. It's not to say that you're the one that's actually in the middle of this. But there's a situation that looks like it's coming up where... It may be, you know, some tea getting ready to come out. Yup, they talk about it. Mm -hmm. They didn't say nothing. They didn't tell you. Tell you everything or they didn't tell you. But you could clearly see that something was going on. Yeah. Yeah, there was a tower moment. Some shocking things were said. Some things got revealed. Somebody was speaking their feelings here. But now it's like they over it. 
Now it's like they're over it, but you still want to hear about it, what happened. They don't. They don't want to talk about it. They don't want to talk about it, but it does look like moving forward. Now we got the Five of Cups. This is someone like crying over spilled milk. But there's a lot of confusion still being around the situation. And it looks like that there's still confusion. It's like it's like there's still some either you're confused about this. You're confused on if these it could be a relationship, okay? But it's like you're confused about it. Like you you a Leo could most definitely be involved. You're confused on whether or not if you want to work this situation out with this person. It looks like a relationship could be involved as well. Like whether or not if you want to work this out, it doesn't necessarily have to be like um a love relationship. It could be a business relationship. It could be, you know, any type of relationship, any type of bond. But it looks like there's some tea, okay? Some tea that's about to get spilled. Uh-huh. It looks like somebody's going to be saying some shocking things. You're going to hear some things. You are might see some things. Um, and you want to know what the tea. What's the tea? What's the tea? <laughs> What's the tea? Hmm. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below, all right? Because this sound a little juicy. This sound a little juicy. <laughs> I will chat with y'all later. Don't forget to like the video, guys, all right? And comment below. I'll chat with y'all later. Ciao.